Hello, I'm John from Robert White Photographic and today I'd like to show you the Ricoh GXR. In front of me, I have a bit of a collection here. Uh, to start with, this is the GXR itself. Ricoh have come up with a very clever idea. Rather than doing a compact sized camera with interchangeable lenses, they've done a compact body with interchangeable camera units. If I press this button here, I'll be able to take off what they call a lens unit. Now, this little lens unit uh, gives the equivalent of 28 to 300 millimeters. It's a lens, it's a shutter, it's a sensor. They do a number of prime lenses and zoom lenses and each follow the same configuration. The benefit of that is that they can choose to change the sensor size to suit the lens that they wish to put in it. For example, this gives you the 28 to 300 equivalent. Well, usually that would mean the lens would be absolutely massive. So to combat that, they put in a smaller sensor. And by a smaller sensor, they can therefore do a shorter focal length lens to give you the equivalent, keeping things nice and compact. Similarly so, if they do wide lenses or some of their primes, they put in a larger sensor, always giving you the 35mm equivalent, but because they can change that sensor, it means that the whole system can retain a really compact size, but also give you great quality. Um, simple to use, very strong little system. Obviously, because the lens units and the shutters are integrated, then you don't have to worry about dust problems, which you would do with an SLR. It's a simple case of locating it, clicking it in, lens unit is ready to go. Um, the GXR has been out for a little while, but our main interest is when they announced this. And this, I'll take the lens I have on it off, is their A12 mount, which takes Leica M lenses. Now, there are obviously systems out there already that do a similar thing. We ourselves do one by Panasonic, uh, a, a Leica M to Micro Four Thirds adapter. So it's not completely and utterly new concept, but it is a very nice way of doing it. If I take this lens unit off now, like so, and pop in the M mount one, so now I have a compact camera with a Leica M mount. Um, this will give you, uh, it's, it's an APS-C size sensor, 12 megapixels, a really usable little camera. So if you are using M lenses, I mean I've got a superb Leica M9P here with a 35 Summicron. I take that off, fits on absolutely perfectly and I can now use the camera as I would with my classic Leica optics. You can also do exactly the same with optics by Zeiss and Voigtlander. We're, we're the Zeiss and Voigtlander importer. Um, fantastic range of lenses. I've got here a lovely compact little Voigtlander 25 f4 and the Zeiss 25 2.8. And in both cases, they'll go on really well. Um, if I just put the Voigtlander on, because I really like the Voigtlander, it keeps everything nice and compact. I'll just put this back on the body, if I may. And that makes a really, really simple to use lens, very accessible, lovely little system. You also have, as an additional item, Rico make a little viewfinder, electronic pop-up viewfinder. That clips on in place here, and now you really can utilize the camera like a mini SLR. So the benefits of an interchangeable lens camera, but with the size of a compact, Using your Leica M, Voigtlander, VM, and Zeiss ZM lenses, we think it's a really, really nice package. There's some great results out there on the internet, um, and it's something that we're planning to stock and do very well with. Um, for any further information, you can visit our website, robertwhite.co.uk, and uh, thank you very much.